What's up? This is Kevin Walker. And this is True School Sports. Canelo Leo Smith next week. That's actually gonna be a good fight, bro. So? That's gonna be a better fight. Mm -hmm. Well, I seen the Triple G versus um, the Count Kale Brook fight, and that was actually a good fight. A far better fight than I thought. He's but a little tall, though, Kell Brook, huh? Kell Brook is 5'9", and Triple G is like 5'10 But he looked, Probably for some reason, I don't know why, Kell five, looked tall. Five, yeah. He looked tall, bro. But Kell Brook was diesel, though. That's what I'm saying. I mean, damn. And Triple G was looking like sickly and shit the whole time. His face was all synced in and shit. Mm -hmm. he, didn't, his, he didn't have no definition in his arms or nothing. I believe I'm. I'm with that. I don't know so, how he won that fight, but he he, he mustered won away. Kill Brooks corner stopped the fight yeah. early. That, 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 that's like Kill Brook never even hit the floor, man. He, Kel, if, if that's the case, they could have stopped it in the first round mm -hmm. because Kell Brook was hurt. He looked like he was about to go down, but he didn't go down. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And then Kell Brook came back and won a couple rounds. Would so, say GGG was like, you know, not as not necessarily as power, but his perceived power. Like, like obviously he's a ball puncher, mm -hmm. but like it's just a fear. Kind of like the, Mike, the Mike Tyson fear factor. Yeah, man. You could tell both fighters was nervous. Yeah. I was watching Triple G, and then when they were singing the national anthem, Triple G had his glove right here. You could see it. You could see he was yeah. nervous as shit. <laughs> he was nervous as shit. I thought Kell Brook was winning that fight before the stop. He should have stayed a little more active. Just kept punching. You know what stopped it? It's because Kell Brook let Triple G throw like 20 or 30 punches. I've seen answer. the rematch right now. I mean, he was trying to tire him out. He was making Triple G miss. But at the same time, you can't let nobody swing at you that many times. They feel like you you, like you defenseless. You know what I'm saying? You letting somebody punch at you that many times. They got to stop. You have the right idea. If I punch at you 30 times. Yeah. And you don't do nothing. Yeah, you might make me miss a few shots. But if I punch at you 30 times and you don't swing back, the referee is going to be looking like, okay, maybe, you know, he's hurt and it might be time to stop the fight. And with, and with the fact that he's always used to winning, Kell Brook is always used to winning. He always wins by... But you know what? The referee was still going to let it go on, though. It was Kell Brook's corner that stopped the fight. I See? You that... know what's funny about that fight, too? is like after his great round two, it's like he almost abandons his jab the rest of the fight. Like I'm sitting there saying, Kell Brook? Yeah, Kell Brook being jabbing like he, he, Right, he, right, he did. Rounds, he's committed to that jab. He's, he's sticking right. it and he's sticking it. And, then he and he's watching him. He, I saw him and watching. Like, right after he has the best round, he's like, you know what? I'm not going to jab no more. I want to just be, I want to try to be Floyd Mayweather. I want to slip a million shots. Yeah, you can't right. do that. You can't do that. Man, he was doing a damn thing, man. I swear. I kind of felt like Kell Brook won those first four rounds. I gave Triple G the third round. I gave Kell Brook the first two. And Triple G kind of came back in the, in the um, matter of fact, I gave Kell Brook the first three because it was stopped in the fifth. And Triple G came back in like the fourth. That's when he really sh like showed him like. It looked like Triple G was desperate though. Triple G was getting tagged, man. His nose was bloody and everything. He Face looked marked up. But even though he won the fight, it still wasn't impressive yeah. because fucking Kell Brook is a welterweight. Yeah. You're supposed to blow him out of the water. He is. But that's the worst performance he's had since he's been in America. He's, yeah. He's, he's, he's yeah. Been in America. And it was against a welterweight. I never.